Welcome to Phoenix 2020, a clear vision for the future. We're right here in Levine and we got some great news. We have a hospital out here in Levine. Yes, Arizona General Hospital by Dignity Health. I mean, it's incredible. People out here in Levine are excited and we have with us the person in charge of the emergency, uh, emergency room, Dr. Moro. Well, welcome. Pleasure. Thank you for coming down. So tell us about the, the emergency room and tell us a little bit about the hospital and how exciting and, and has it has it been used at all? Yeah, oh, has it been used? It's been overwhelming. You know, our response by the community has been overwhelming. We opened up this 40,000 square foot facility behind us here. It's a beautiful new build here in Levine. Uh, from a standpoint of, uh, you know, access to care, I think it's important for the people of Levine to have that, but it's a very modern, state-of-the-art facility. We've got 16 beds in the hospital over here. Uh, we've got nine beds in the ER. We're seeing, uh, you know, 80 patients a day here without wow. any ambulance traffic yet. 80 patients a day? Yeah, we're up to 80 patients oh, a day, which cow. is a lot more than we expected initially based on our projections. So, you know, our staffing is trying to keep up with that, but uh, for the most part, I think what makes the Levine special is the relationship we've developed with the people in, in the community. Uh, it's always, uh, it, working in the ER is a job unless you have, you know, job satisfaction. And I think uh, most of our docs are real happy with the people that we're seeing coming in because they're really happy that we're here. And that makes it a lot easier to take care of them. So we look forward to that relationship building. There's been some growing pains and some frustrations, I think, you know, in the beginning just great. because we're, we're trying to catch up with the, the need that's here. We weren't anticipating this great of a need. But now that we know what we're dealing with, I think it's going to be a lot easier for us to staff it and get the, the care to the people that they expect to have, just like everywhere else in the city. So we're, we're really happy to be here. You know, Dr south of the river there's no hospital there's no facility like this yeah. so there is such a great need for south phoenix for levine That's and right. even the astria mountain um, village you know one of the things is um about a week ago my um, brother-in-law had a heart attack and my sister-in-law rushed him to the emergency room here and yeah. and you basically saved his life you know i really want to thank you on behalf of my family for everything you're doing and you know you thought about not just the patient but the whole family and one of the things my wife said is they even have a place to plug in your your iphone and you guys thought of everything they really did you know the focus for the uh dignity adeptus relationship that we're building here in arizona is customer service and you know when we're seeing the volumes that we're seeing if, if, if people have come in and not had that experience we want them to have that experience we've done everything we can to make sure that it's a it's it's almost like being at home we try to build the nicest house on the block so that people want to be here and if they if they do have to wait a little bit to be seen that they're at least comfortable in that environment um, but, you know, we're working the best we can to get the staffing ratios where we need to get them to get patients in and out quickly because that's what people want. Uh, and I'm glad we were able to take care of it. How often do you have a relationship with, a, with the council person who's been in your ER already? <laughs> We've been open three months. But, you know, providing that care is what we do. It's what we want to do. It's what we love to do. It's why we're here. Uh, we look forward to expanding not only in the area of Lean, but the rest of Arizona as well. There's lots of underserved areas in Arizona that need that access to care, and we look to bring it. So, yeah, we do have the, uh, the concentration really on the, the quality of customer service and the comforts of home in the hospital, which people are not accustomed to, but that's what we do. That's what we're here for. Well, doctor, the 16 rooms, they're like luxury um, hotel rooms. I mean, it's beautiful. The, the, the chairs, the sofas, the, the facility itself. I mean, it's like walking into a five-star hotel. I mean, you guys have really done a class act here. You've brought the standard of hospitals to a whole different level, and you built it here in Levine. So that's thank right. you so much. And sure. what, you know, what's coming up next is a medical center where that's we right. can actually have doctors and health Care right here in That's Levine, right. so you don't have to travel five or seven miles away from Levine. We can actually have doctors here. Yeah, I think it's great. You know, the medical office building space behind us here that's going up, it's going to bring the primary care to the hospital. And what that's going to mean is that patients will not only be able to be seen in the ER, but also have their follow up locally. And so I think that's real important. What, you know, what good is it to be in the ER and then two weeks later you have to follow up with your doc, you know, 12 miles away? So by having the medical office space next door, those primary physicians can bring their practice here to Levine the same way that we brought an emergency department to Levine. And I agree with you, the hospital is beautiful. It's a pleasure to work here. We really enjoy it. You know, we're real happy with the, the local talent that we've recruited to work here, in addition to the space that was provided to us by Dignity and Adeptus. We're real proud of it. But Dr. Moro, thank you for everything you guys are doing. And you got a great staff, customer service. And if you have to come to a hospital, you live out here in Levine, this is the state of the art hospital to come right. to. And I just want to thank everyone who's been involved with this. I mean, for the last five years, we've been pushing and fighting for a hospital out here in Levine, and we finally got it. And we want to thank Dignity Health. We want to thank Arizona General Hospital. And thank you, thank you, thank you. And we have a hospital in Levine.